Now you're going to learn how to open and reply to a message protected with multi-factor authentication. There are four different ways an end user can apply multi-factor authentication. Email, password, phone, or single sign-on. If you need to see a specific way to open and reply to a message, here are the timestamps for each method. They are also in the description down below. The first method we will review is the email method. To open an email with multi-factor authentication, all you need to do is press this button that says Authenticate to decrypt an open message. This will lead you to a new secure browser where you will see this screen. At the bottom, you will see that you are prompted to enter your email address where you will receive a unique code. Once this code is entered, you are now permitted to view the message. To reply, just press the blue button that says reply, and now you and the sender can send encrypted emails in this secured browser. Next, we're going to review the password method. To open an email with multi-factor authentication, all you need to do is press this button that says authenticate to decrypt an open message. This will lead you to a new secure browser where you will see this screen. At the bottom, you see that you are prompted to enter a password. The sender also has the option to send you a hint for the password. In this case, it is the company name. However, it is always important to use a unique password to keep messages as safe as possible. After the password is entered, you are now permitted to view the message. To reply, just press the blue button that says reply, and now you and the sender can send encrypted emails in this secure browser. Next, we will review the phone option. To open an email with multi-factor authentication, all you need to do is press this button that says authenticate to decrypt an open message. This will lead you to a new secured browser where you will see this screen. At the bottom, you see that you are prompted to enter your phone number where you will receive a unique code. Once this code is entered, you are now permitted to view the message. To reply, just press the blue button that says reply, and now you and the sender can send encrypted emails in this secured browser. Next, we will review the single sign-on option. To open an email with multi-factor authentication, all you need to do is press this button that says authenticate to decrypt an open message. This will lead you to a new secure browser where you will see this screen. This specific example shows authentication via Google. However, you can also authenticate through Microsoft and Yahoo. When you click this, you will then choose the email address the message was sent to in order to authenticate identity. After this, you will be permitted to view the message. To reply, just press the blue button that says reply, and now you and the sender can send encrypted emails in this secure browser. Thank you for joining us at Trustify. Hit subscribe for future updates and instructional videos. Follow us on our social media pages in the description down below. We will see you next time.